The Freeride World Tour takes the best freeriders, male and female, ski and snowboard, and pitches them up on some of the most spectacular mountain faces in the world. We delve behind the scenes to find out how these amazing athletes do what they do. This is face value. Okay. Listen up, scallywags. We're here at the Freeride World Tour Geography Department, and I am Professor Graham. Okay, so the tour is actually starting in Japan, all the way over here. Sushi Hakuba, let's go. Then we're gonna end up here, British Columbia. Golden Kicking Horse. Then we're gonna go all the way over here. Just here, very small country. It is, in fact, Andorra. And the resort is called Ordino Anais. Ordino Valise. Ordino Arcalis. Ordino Arcalis. From Andorra, the tour is going to pop up north. Austria, Fieberbrunn. And then we're going to finish up the world tour, the world tour final in Verbier, Switzerland. We're about to head out on a run with Japanese free ski legend, Yu Sasaki. He knows this place like the back of his hand, so hopefully we're gonna get some goods. Let's go. Let's <laughs> get the pow. We're rolling, yeah. We did. Yeah, I was like, uh-oh. <laughs> yeah, woo! Backflip play. So this is traditional uh, Japanese barbecue? Yeah, it's called uh, yakitori. Yakitori. Yeah. Hakuba is pretty much the biggest area to go yeah. skiing on the yeah. South Island. Yeah, I think so, yeah. Mm -hmm. And there's like 10 resorts around here? I or? think more than 10. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's so many ski resorts, it gets closer. For me, when I see Japanese snowboarders and skiers, yeah. everyone has a lot of style. Okay. Like the, just the way you guys are turning and how you yeah, yeah. connect with the snow and it, I yeah, that, that's true. Yeah, because uh, it's the outbound is a pretty less, mm -hmm. so people skiing inbound, how enjoy from the inbound. Best of luck tomorrow. Okay, uh, can't wait to see to see you shredding and um, yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah. I hope to see you on the podium. <laughs> Close finger. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I'm about to go meet up with the current World Tour champion and also two times winner here at the stop in Hakuba is Ariana Tricomi. Let's see what she's got to say. Yo, Paddy! How are you? Good to see you, man. Yeah. Thanks for joining, eh? Yeah, got some nice tea for you. Oh, nice. The matcha. Matcha. <laughs> <laughs> So, are you one of the people who started to ski as soon as you could walk? I started telemarking when I was oh, really? six. Yeah. Huh. And my mom showed me, I guess, like all the aspects of skiing when I was really young. Where do you see your skiing going this year? I have a plan actually. I'd love to maybe bring a little more style, even more shifties, more tail grabs. I'd love to do some 360s. And of course, the dream would be to do a backflip, but that's more of a personal thing for me because it's been a trick that I've been struggling with it. I just want to ski the way I want to ski, and I, don't, I never really adapted my skiing for the tour. And I really want to stay true to that without thinking too much about the triple and the points and blah, 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 and just keep that style and hopefully, yeah, get better. Yeah. Obviously, having fun while skiing is really important to you. How important is it to win then? Because I find sometimes those mentalities clash. I'm super happy I won 
twice. I mean, if you win, I think that's, of course, a big motivation. Mm -hmm. But like the days that I won were not the best days for me because I had so many nice powder days with my friends where you like ski in the trees and you hear everyone screaming for joy and then you see their faces at the end of the run. This is what is skiing for me. I don't know. I, I want to go skiing now. I'm pumped to go skiing tomorrow. And you're going to show me around. All right, that's a deal. <laughs> Cheers. Boom. Woo! That's some Japanese pal. Since Mary and I are such big fans of Japanese food, we decided to come to a local supermarket. I'm going to find something for you to eat, and you have to find something for me to eat. Let's okay? do it. Yeah. Ten minutes on the clock. Let's go. Fish heads. Come with me. Oh, God. Ah, crickets. Here we go. I got it. I can't get those, like, that's just really mean. Oh, Christ, we're done. I don't have anything. Crickets. I, I found a, a bag of pickled eggs. That's OK. That's not the really? worst. Yeah, I prefer to eat that compared to that. Really? Yeah. All right. They're not too bad. They're sweet. I hate you. Mm. Mm. Yeah, I like it. Oh, she's, she's finishing it off. Well, now we're fully stocked up on proteins. Marion's got to go do the free ride world tour. I think you'll be ready. I'm ready. <laughs> There are two ways to get onto the Freeride World Tour. You either get a wild card, which basically means you're invited, or you go through a qualification process. We're about to head out for a little skin to get some backcountry Japan action with Konsti Otner, who's gone through the grueling qualification process. I remember the first video I saw of you was the run in Hockfugen and that massive backflip. It was actually the biggest backy I ever did, maybe. Even the, my lens popped out in the landing from the impact. <laughs> What's it going to feel like when you're in the start gate? And this is such a great beginning to be finally here, skiing with all the homies from the tour. And yeah, here it's all about the good times. And that's what I, what I really like about skiing. There are so many legends on the whole tour. It's going to be really cool to be able to compete with them and ski with them. Yeah, if you would have asked me like, yeah, even two years ago, I'm going to compete with Tenor. I would have laughed about you. <laughs> <laughs> how, would you how would you best describe your skiing and your style? Yeah, I definitely want to bring some creative stuff and some big hits. That's my type, favorite type of skiing, but I'm always keen to try something new. Well, I'm really looking forward to seeing you ski this year. Thank You're you. definitely one of my favorite riders in the, <laughs> in the start list. And uh, yeah, let's get up there and get a couple of turns in. Oh yeah, so keen. Let's do it. Pretty nice. We're at a good vantage point um, to see the face from. The snowboarders are just dropping in and just been hanging out with the, the skiers. And it's quite different to how I imagined it actually. Like everyone's like super friendly and they're all talking about the lines they want to do and what they've been scoping. And I was expecting it to be like cold as ice up here, but it's very relaxed, very chilled out. 
Have you been watching the guys riding? Yeah, yeah. there's some nice side hits. Boom, boom. Kind of changed my land a little bit. Yeah. Stock. yeah that's yeah. good. That's a good sign, though. Huh? I always <laughs> do when better. I watch other people. Yeah. It's just I, I have to ask you about the 360 because yeah, I think I can do it. Yeah, for sure. Ten seconds. It just feels great to be here skiing with all those legends you, you were always looking up to and then you're here and having a good time with them. Sick. Dude, I'm looking forward to the rest of the tour. Yes, thank be you so much. <laughs> Let's do it! How are you feeling after Supermarket Challenge? Because uh, I was feeling a bit ropey. I'm sorry for you. <laughs> <laughs> but it, it, it didn't affect your run anyway. No, no, it's okay. Uh, my stomach was so good and I got so much energy from Jap Japanese food. You just won again. Yeah. Awesome stuff. Super stoked. It was super cool today. Amazing snow and I got so much fun. How was the run? We talked about it before you went. You managed to hit everything, get the three in there. Almost. I did the three. It was really cool. I'm super happy about it actually. But then I missed the cliff afterwards because it just came up super fast. So I just skipped it because I was just like having so much fun. So I didn't want to force something just to get more points. So I just like enjoyed my run and I wish it would have been like at least double as long or like even mm -hmm. more. Yo, yo, mic check, one, two. How much did I want to get? 20, 50, 6,000. So I'll get 10. I'm going to go to the trouser clothes. What's it called? What's up, Freeride fans? If you like what you saw on the Freeride World Tour, if you want to see some more action from the snow world, then hit the subscribe link below. Follow Red Bull Snow, you can get all the action.